loving. We were loving being on holiday. You can hear there's an ing at the end of love, and ing is a suffix. So let's write love first. Starts with a l, followed by an a, but it's actually an o. So I actually sometimes say love to help me remember. Okay, l a or o, followed by a v. Now you can't leave it like that. You have to put a secret e at the end. Okay, so that's love. I actually say love because to me it looks like love. Now to add the ing, you have to take away the secret e, and then you put the ing. So whenever there's a secret or magic e or silent e, you cross it out and you put the suffix ing. Loving. It always helps to break longer words up, so you can look for syllable patterns, vowel, consonant, consonant, vowel, break it between the consonants, or you could look for vowel, consonant, vowel. So let's see what we see in loving. We should be able to see one of these patterns. There's vowel, consonant, vowel, so we break it up after the O, loving or loving. How do you spell loving? L O V I N G. L O V I N G. Loving.